Okay, this is just going to be a little help video. Um, first thing, somebody asked me, how do you know when you go to make... Okay, let me make a wall. Okay, that's the first thing we're going to do. Is Let's see here. I'll make a cube. Take the cube tool, and I'm going to pull it out. Now you can see it's orientation now, right? And the guy wanted to know, how in the world do you make it flat or up and down? How do you do that? Well, do you see this work plane here? This grid right here. Not the black one, but this one running straight up and down. Whichever which way that is facing is the way you're going to draw your geometry. So if I rotate my camera so far, you can see this grid, choop, it snaps flat. Now when I do that, it lays flat, see? So you got to watch that. So let me rotate this back up. Because I want to make a cube along this, like this. Okay, now let's be selected. I'm just getting this ready. I'm going to axis divide it. I'm going to axis slice it, I mean. I'm going to, the number, I'm going to make it pretty good. Maybe eight in all directions. And click. So now we've got that. Okay, so now somebody want to know what's the best way to make a window? Suppose this is a wall. What's the fastest, easiest way to make a window? And you could go in there and select this side, select this side, delete it, you know, whatever. But here's the easiest way in Modo. Select the ones you want on either side. Okay, you can see I've got them selected on both sides. I'm going to hit the B key and bevel this in a little bit. Okay, however big I want my window seal or whatever it's going to be. Drop the tool. Go to duplicate and just hit bridge. And click. Bam! Look at there. Wonderful. Let me show you something else that's cool. Let me select this one. I'll go up to my special tools. And let me see if I can find it here. And boom, look at that. It makes This is a special script I got. It's not available. I'm just wanting to show you guys how easy it is to make holes in something. Now that we've got them both, now I'm going to select both sides, like just like I did with the window. I'm going to bevel them in a little bit. Drop the tool and hit bridge. And boom, look at there. If I hit the tab key, we have a perfect hole and a perfect little notch out, cut out. So that's the easiest way to cut holes in something. Okay. Um, and how you draw your geometry is dependent on which way that little work plane, it's called your work plane, which way that work plane is oriented, okay? So um, we can get into the work plane later because we've got all kinds of stuff. We can um, reset it. You can align work plane to selection. So we can reset the work plane or I can select that and say align work plane to selection and boom, look at that. It's aligned our work plane right to our selection. We can get into all that later. I just basically wanted to show you how to make a quick hole in something or um, kind of explain the work plane and how you drew your geometry. If you draw it with it facing like that, it's going to be flat. If you draw it with it like this, it's going to be up and down like this. I hope that makes sense. Thanks for watching, guys.